And good Wednesday evening. I'm Kelsey Gerkins in the first alert weather center and we really saw that warm up today. That ridge of high pressure inching on in and as we go into your Thursday forecast, this is when the ridge is going to be peaking. So tomorrow actually quite a bit warmer than what we had out there today. Spots that were in the 70s are going to be hitting the 80s and we do have our inland areas getting well into the 90s. Now Friday is still going to be warm, but we will see that start to weaken. So this will allow for a couple degrees of cooling. We're also going to be seeing some of that onshore flow once again, which is going to lead to more cloud cover for the weekend. So let's go ahead and take a look at what you can expect when it comes to those winds tonight. Pretty windy along the Santa Barbara South Coast. In fact, we do have a wind advisory tonight for the Santa Barbara South Coast and the Santa Barbara County Mountains. This continues until 6 a.m. Thursday as we deal with those north northwest winds anywhere from 15 to 30 miles per hour. Those strongest winds really going to be in the Gaviota area as well as the San Marcos Pass. So you can see as we head towards 7 p.m. the sun is setting Santa Barbara Goleta both in the double digits. It does get stronger as we get to 9 o'clock there in Santa Barbara and it stays windy all throughout those overnight hours for the Santa Barbara South Coast. So we do have another windy night ahead. Really not getting a break from this wind event when it comes to those late night hours. Once we get to Thursday morning though, we'll start to see those calmer conditions. It does get breezy again Thursday afternoon into Thursday evening. So breaking down your day planner forecast Santa Barbara. You're at 71 degrees in the morning. That is a warm start to the day and it is going to be a hot day by the afternoon mid 80s for you at 2 p.m. Later into those evening hours at 7 p.m. Enjoying a very warm 80 one degree so warm out there. This is some warm summer weather here happening at the end of April. Maybe a pool day. I made a full forecast for you. This is for San Inez for tomorrow. Again, the peak of this heat wave. If you can go enjoy some of those outdoor activities, you can see as we get to 2 p.m. We're in the upper 80s there in the San Inez Valley. The San Inez Valley will cool down quicker than Santa Barbara's. It gets down to 69 degrees there at 7 p.m. Your highs for tomorrow. Galita hits the 80s. A nice high of 82. Carpinteria 82 degrees as well up into Lompoc, your high temperature is going to be at 76. Upper 70s in Santa Maria and Orchid. Well, if you're in Buellton, you get up to 86 degrees. San Luis Obispo, warm day for you as you climb into the 80s with a high at 83. Paso is the warmest spot there at 91 degrees. And those Central Coast beaches. They're going to be the place to go if you really hate the heat, but even they're warming up. Lots of mid 70s out there. But Tur County beaches, they're going to make their way into the 80s, while Ojai, you get up to 91. That's a look at your forecast. Remember, Thursday, the peak of this heat wave, will start to get a little bit cooler by the weekend. Check in with me at 11 o'clock tonight for your full weather forecast.